religions are odd. It's often been said that all religions are the same. They just emphasize different things and use different words and symbols. Well, I would say that all religions do answer the same kind of questions, the questions I earlier called limit questions at human experience, and emerge from limit experiences. But of course, they, they differ enormously, both in, the, in terms of where they begin, how they begin, what questions are central to them, and for the religions like the biblical religions and other religions, that believe that there is a revelation or a self-manifestation of God, either in events, historical events like Sinai and Exodus, and then event in person of Jesus the Christ for Christians, in the text of the Korah for Muslims, then of course these are enormously different, either from religions which, and there are many, which do not believe in any strict sense in revelation, but nevertheless have this profound religious sense of life, this other dimension to life, or in terms of what they emphasize and what they don't emphasize, what issues strike them as the most important issues. Buddhism for me is mostly concerned, mostly, most forms of Buddhism that I'm aware of, is mostly concerned, for example, not with the issue like biblical religions of guilt and responsibility and justice and love, it's concerned mostly with the issue of transience and the greatness, the, the extraordinary fact of how life passes on, even as we speak here, it's all passing on, it goes. And the greatness of Buddhism, which I love to me, is that the problem is also the solution if one would let go to it, if one would cease clinging to time, to this moment, and let it pass and see the beauty of it. I think that it's, it really doesn't lead very far to think that all the religions are the same. They're all the same in the sense that they ask, I repeat, the same kind of questions, limit questions, and come from the same kind of experiences, limit experiences. But the experiences are so different, and the questions are so differently formulated, that it finally is more helpful, I think, to study them individually and to learn from them individually than it is to learn from them under some common denominator.